Hello, YouTubers. All right, quick tech tip here for you. Uh, when you're doing a head gasket on an LS or any other engine, uh, one of the most important things you can do is clean out the studs ahead of time. You don't want your threads having uh, gunked up. I mean, even if you sent them to a machine shop um, and they uh, clean the blocks and all that stuff, you definitely don't uh, have everything perfectly clean from that. So if you are replacing the uh, bolts, you can take an old uh, bolt like this, the old head bolt, and just cut a little groove into it like that. All right, and essentially this guy with a little bit of brake cleaner and you just uh, spray it in the hole there, standing off to the side. Doesn't take long for that. And you're just looking to run this in there, nothing crazy, don't impact it or anything. I always try to get a couple threads going. And then I'll run it in and out a couple times. And then pull it out and inspect it. Make sure there's nothing on there. Sometimes you'll be surprised what you pull out and how much gunk you pull out, even after they've been to the machine shop. Because water will settle in there from those uh, machines, and sometimes it'll actually rust if the engine block sits a little while. So always clean out your threads, and that'll ensure a proper torque and a better torque surface. So that way your engine uh, doesn't blow a head gasket in the future. A uh, couple quick seconds there, basically. And uh, last but not least, if you have a decent compressor, throw a little air in it. All right, so there you go. Nothing too crazy, just something simple. Old head bolt, and with that groove, it'll help clean anything out. It'll actually bring the trash out with it most of the time, and then the air does the rest of the work for you. So, okay, so just get the junk out of the holes, basically, uh, throw that air in there, stand off the side, obviously, you don't want that spraying back, doesn't hurt to wear safety glasses. Uh, last but least, before applying your head gasket, wipe it down really good, brake cleaner again, throw it on some rag, and just wipe it off. Clean surfaces, always the best surface. On your head gaskets, brand new, use second time, use third time, whatever the quality or ability of these guys are. Copper spray a gasket, you can't go wrong. It, it basically creates uh, an adhesion that helps seal. So uh, as long as you don't have any runs in it as you spray it onto your head gasket, both sides, not on the actual engine block or the heads, just the gasket itself, spray both sides, a nice layer, nothing crazy thick, uh, it's gonna help. The, there's nothing wrong with that. Any extra is better especially if you get into the crazy horsepower or performance tuning. So a nice thin layer, and I already did this one for. You can still see the writing and stuff. So we're not crazy thick. Differences between the two, but it is on there. So spray it on, let it dry just a little bit, and then commence to building your engine, and you're good to go. You can have that one drying uh, while, uh, or the next one drying while you're assembling the other side, basically. So copper is never a bad thing. Cheap insurance. Hope that helps out. Comments, like, subscribe. Appreciate anything you guys got to say.